Hello friends, Yossi Kaplan here, your friendly Toronto Realtor. Today I'm at Queen West. Behind me is 1171 Queen West, the Bohemian Embassy, and 1161, which is the other part of it. Uh, right here is 68 Abel, and above us is 1181 Queen West. Now guess what? All these buildings average about $1,000 a foot. That's it. New buildings today average $1,300 to $2,000 a foot. So how come these buildings, which are fantastic in my opinion, only average about a thousand dollars a foot well here is it the new buildings the pre-con they coming in toronto are coming in much higher cost because the cost to developers is much higher than it used to be a cost to developer today is about a thousand dollars a foot just to build okay so they can't really sell you anything under 13 14 1500 square foot without even breaking even because they have other costs too but the buildings that already exist, okay, right here, uh, they're good. They're already completed, they've been paid for, and they're running. You also, remember, you don't have to pay any closing costs on existing condos or houses. So, because of that, that makes resale market much more attractive and with the economic situation that we're in now where we have high interest pushing prices down and people are kind of not sure if they want to buy or not uh, we actually got into a situation where buildings are more affordable than maybe they were a year or two ago so what does that mean that tells me that if i were in the market to buy property i may do it now when there's an expectation in the market will rise up again and there is that sort of expectation obviously the people that can afford to buy now could do it and probably if all this is correct do really well in a couple of years imagine in a couple of years that we finally out of the situation we're at and things are stable and the common economy is flourishing again prices could bounce up a lot more the other thing is when all these pre-construction they were sold at 13 14 15 and even two thousand dollars a foot come ready which is the next uh 2024 2025 the next couple of years everything else will have to catch up because you know if you if you paid fifteen hundred dollar a foot uh plus a few more dollars a foot for your closing costs and all that so you're going to need to get at least $1,600 a foot to break even. So the prices of these pre-cons that came online will be higher and they're going to push the resale market up. That happens all the time. But now we have a bit of a lull, a bit of a window of opportunity, I want to say, that could make it very attractive for you to look in the resale market again. So my contacts down below. If you want to know more about the market or if you want to know any good deals that are coming out and there are quite a few good deals out on the market right now, let me know. Yossi Kaplan.